Most people think that sugar causes children's behaviour problems, but it doesn't. The thing is, not all sugars are equal. So white sugar and icing sugar and maple syrup are all very low in salicylates. Brown sugar and golden syrup are still low in salicylates, but they're higher than the others. And if you're having problems with the diet, if the diet's not working, it's best to cut those out for now. Raw sugar is moderate in salicylates and it's never permitted on the elimination diet. And honey is high. It's actually used as a salicylate challenge. People who think that their children are reacting to sugar are generally feeding their kids too many salicylates.